All right, David, your reaction on behalf of the institution regarding the birth of the royal baby? Naturally, the institution is delighted to welcome their safe arrival of the newborn, a uh, new child, and congratulations to the Duke and Duchess of Cambridge on the safe arrival of the newly born son. And of course, congratulations also to the great grandmother, Her Majesty Queen Elizabeth II, on this, the birth of her great grandson. Uh, and that's a very significant year, uh, the diamond uh, jubilee of Her Majesty's coronation. There's obviously a sense of pride amongst brethren, particularly given the baby will one day be king. Absolutely, we're delighted to think that it's quite significant also that the child is here and uh, the the three heirs to the throne alive, Charles, William and now the newborn. It's very significant and the institution is absolutely delighted. And David, you yourself have a close affinity with William and Kate and indeed the entire royal family have attended numerous events over the years. Absolutely, uh, I'm a a royalist, a fanatical royalist. I've photographed the royal family for many years now at many different events. Uh, Troop of the Colours, the Queen's visit to Northern Ireland, but of course the royal wedding uh, two years ago was a big occasion and I was at there also. So yes, uh, nice to be around. History in the making. And just lastly David, there's obviously much speculation regarding the baby's name. Would you yourself have any preference? Well, naturally, of course, I'd love the child to be called David. We know that's not going to happen. Um, I suppose after that, let's hope it's not James, because that'll have its own little story in its own right. Uh, but I'm, I'm secretly hoping that the, the child will be called William. It'd be nice to know that one day we have a future King William on the throne.